Just another quick video showing the race meter in action. Just the and have a look here, see what we can spot that yellow one on the far side, Invincible Lan. He's lagging behind, you could see from the side on there, so I'm going to look for a lay on him. We go, get the lane, got that at 11. Really struggling. It's not making any ground, so we'll go and exit that anyway. And then we'll have a look at what the drones do, because there's always drones here. Let's go and trade out of that. There we go. Uh, there's the drone move there, so you can see which one's won. This Global Prospector has won, even though it's still second when they made that move. You see there it's gone 101 just before it took the lead. But they were a couple of seconds ahead, and they knew. But I'll just uh, I'll go back and show you what happened there and how the race meter works. Okay, so you see here, Global Prospector, there's the big move where it went green. And look at it, it's still third at the moment, and it's gone to 1.4. And this is where I just did the quick sort on the grid, pushing the Q button. There it is. It's gone 115. It's still second. 104. It's still behind. 102. And you can see there that, that they've already made their decision. They're a couple of seconds ahead of these pitches. And so they know the horse has gone 101 now and it's only just gone past. But have a look at it there, 104, and it's still uh, not even in front. And then it just careers away and they can see it's going to win easy. So that is how you can use the race meter to your advantage to be quicker than anyone else at spotting what the drone boys are backing. And then you can either click a button to back it or you can get on and lay it. But that is how you use the race meter to combat the drones on BetJet Pro.